heard stories that during partition women from different communities were raped men and women and children were murdered we are living in the shadow of those communal rights and here 75 years post independence we are still stuck in that that the two communities or different religious communities cannot live together and that when they are angry women are the softest targets so i mean i th- i didn't even blink an eyelid when i thought that this is a pit case to be taken up conflict in my mind because i do realize that in case of rape accused feels that he will be convicted he tends to murder the uh, victim and therefore uh, we may not be able to collect enough evidence and he may go scot free but general impression which i get uh, from the society is that though Uh, an officer like me has a conflict whether we should go in for death penalty for rape with murder or not people want it and here we had a case where the court had convicted the accused under three counts of rape mind you rape uh, of a pregnant woman gang rape and murder under seven counts so now i felt actually this was a fit case where even capital punishment could have been considered and instead we are remitting uh, all the accused and we are setting them free we are welcoming them we are garlanding them so uh, there is a hindi word you know akrosh so i felt so agitated uh, that me and our group we decided that this is an absolute the fit case where we should approach the supreme court uh, and uh, file a public interest litigation the three petitioners me madhu ma'am and professor choker we have no alliance uh, with any political party we are just uh, representatives of civil society so we felt that civil society must be represented and therefore we implemented messages women without boundaries that if a woman is being harassed she is being exploited and extreme facts like rape gang rape rape of pregnant women uh, is taking place we should not uh, remain silent in fact remaining silent itself becomes a crime religious and communal conflicts apart uh the society must uh, voice their concern and not allow these conflicts to aggravate to a point where seven murders uh including a 1 3 days old child 1 3 and a half years old girl uh that takes place in india and we remain silent so when we filed the petition 
the whole process has been so opaque that we didn't know that central government's um, consent had been taken. I would say that to my mind and to the mind of our group, uh, the process has been faulty. It has not uh, been as per section 432 of the uh, criminal procedure court. Our group feels since the sentencing court was in Maharashtra, whether uh, processing of remission by Gujarat government is lawful or not. So we are requesting that you please upload the whole process and then let the Supreme Court review it.